facing intensifying pressure over the migrant influx at the U.S. southern border. This morning, President Biden is preparing to announce sweeping changes. NBC News has learned the executive action would allow the president to temporarily shut down the border to asylum seekers if illegal crossings reach 2,500 a day, according to three people familiar with the discussions. It is definitely a step in the right direction, one of a number of steps that are necessary for us to be able to secure our border. But some Republicans say it's too little, too late. He created a crisis at the border intentionally. Right now, Homeland Security officials say there are more than 4,000 encounters at the border each day, suggesting a shutdown could go into effect immediately. The border would reopen if daily encounters dropped below 1,500. This migrant just crossed near San Diego and says the new restrictions would be tough. Coming on the heels of a historic presidential election in Mexico, and just as the campaign here in the U.S. heats up, the move is a reversal from President Biden's stance in January. All I can do. Even though Mr. Trump urged congressional Republicans to kill a bipartisan border funding bill earlier this year, the former president has a 30-point edge with registered voters on the question of who would handle immigration and border security better. Immigrant advocates say the changes will cause chaos. It is a betrayal of what we were told um, in a campaign four years ago. We were told that President Biden would be restoring humanity at our border. But what we are seeing is that history is repeating itself. In 2018, the Trump administration tried to enact similar border restrictions, but the courts struck them down. We expect more legal challenges now. The executive action will also have some humanitarian exceptions, including for children who we'll arrive at the border alone. All right, Gabe Gutierrez on the North Lawn there. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.